That's right. We're on live. We're going to get this thing done one way or another. What's up to y'all? Welcome to Third Eye Visions, where we motivate the blind, stimulate your mind, and welcome all kind. I am so tired of, and you can fill in a blank with whatever you so desire. Um, for you newcomers, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so that you can get the updates that I present every so often. But the thing of it is, I would love for you to share, love for you to like and make sure to subscribe again i am so tired of this came to my mind this morning i was just sitting around the coffee table and i said you know i've experienced so much in my life thus far that has just really fuck with me bad and i just thought i wanted to share some of these things that really get on my nerves that really hurt my nerves that really pisses me the pisses me off so in no particular order um i would just like to share some of these things that's really getting on my nerves <clears throat> that i am so tired of number one i am so tired of all the violence more specifically when this happens innocent people are being killed and this has happened too frequent in my neighborhoods and all other neighborhoods abroad and I am so tired of it. I'm also so tired of lame excuses that people are making for not doing them, you know, doing themselves great deeds in order to uh, bring them out of whatever situation they are in. They make so many excuses. I have been around so many individuals who have been so many excuses for why they're not succeeding till it's just pitiful. So I'm just so, so tired of it. Number three, I am so tired of some Caucasian people still feeling entitled after all these years, after all the proof that has uh, been presented about certain situations they still feel that they are entitled. I am so tired of that. I'm also so tired, so, so tired of blind YouTubers with these simple how-to videos. I mean, it just makes me think that we have to prove to the world that we are able to do simplistic things or things that normal individuals can do with sight such as how to get in a car i've seen a video on a youtube channel that i, I will not uh, mention the name but the title of it of it was how blind people get into a car duh number five i am so tired of dead beat parents bringing children into the world and not taking care of them at all and I have um, prime examples of this actually happen, happening from firsthand experience. But uh, as a whole, I have seen on numerous amount of occasions where people just have kids and don't give a fuck about them. All the time that you put in bringing these children in the world, you mean to tell me you don't want them? I'm so tired of this. It's just petty, pretty pretty effed up. I am so tired of limited opportunities for visually impaired individuals. And it may have something to do with where I'm from, but there are, limit, uh, there are limited opportunities for individuals who are visually impaired to try to succeed, to try to work, to try to provide. And that has been the reason why I have created my own lane in terms of me creating my own uh, opportunities so that I won't be an individual 
who just sit around just hoping that things happen. Um, number seven, I'm going to definitely um, ruffle some feathers with this one. I am so tired of religious fanatics saying that in order to eliminate or uh, alleviate the woes of the world, AKA your troubles, there's only one thing that you need to do. Uh, is it really that simple? And there's nothing against individuals who um, are strong believers in things of that nature, but is it really that really that uh, easy? Because right now, man, there, there is so much, um, there's so much confusion that is going on in the world today. I don't know if just this one simple thing that they claim to do can actually uh, curtail any of this violence, any of this corruption, just any anything that's bad that's happening in the world today. Um, I am so tired, number eight, of people saying that the election wasn't stolen. There's proof on top of proof on top of proof on top of proof to show that um, this was a fair election. But so many people still want to claim uh, that the election was stolen. I'm so tired of it. Um, here's another one that may also ruffle feathers. I am so tired of trans transgender, excuse me, some of them wanting to be fair, equal, and separate at the same time. And I'm not going to go into any detail as to why I feel this way or what uh, brought me to feel this way because that is a title for another subject, but you just give that some sort of thought and see what's going on in the world today when it comes to transgenders. Mm, mm. I am, number 11, I am so tired of the idea of not being able to leave some sort of uh, financial assistance for my child who will be attending college. Um, and I say that because the opportunities not too many of them are not are out there, so we may have to either get a grant or something to that effect. But unlike uh, other families who are born into um, a, a situation where they have numerous amount of money, I'm not that person. So I'm so, so tired of this idea of not being able to, but I will make it happen some sort of way. Uh, I'm so, number 12, I'm so tired of hearing about schools not wanting to teach critical race theory in their school. Why not? Why not show the truth? Why not tell the truth? Are you afraid of the truth? Maybe because you can't handle the truth. Could that be the situation? Mm. And I'm, I'm also so tired of people saying that or hearing the phrase talking white. And I'm, I'm, I am also so tired of black dialect being associated with Ebonics. I'm just so tired of all that shit. I am also so tired of constantly thinking of how people, and this has to do with music and the powers to be in the blues uh, uh, industry, has allowed the traditional blues to just fade away. And now we have what is known as Southern Soul Blues. Understanding there are a lot of um, blues artists who have passed on, but there should have been a way to preserve their um, hard work. Now, there are a lot of white individuals who have kept this type of blues going. I don't want to elaborate too much on this another topic, but it just it just it just irks me to know that there's no more no no more association of any type of blues traditionally. The Bobby Blue Bands, the ZZ Hills. <clears throat> the Johnny Taylor Jr., uh, Johnny Taylors, the um, Little Miltons. Um, I mean, there's no preservation of this. Even when they, 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 when when these individuals were alive, there was no situation where they had any type of award ceremonies that was associated with the Grammys and all these others. But anyway, that's another day, another topic. But I just want to just get on here and let you know of some of the things that just really piss me off that I'm so tired of. So with that being said, thanks for subscribing to Third Eye Visions, where we motivate the blind 
again, stimulate your mind, which I hope that I've done, and welcome all kind. Thank you. Thank you.